Yo, hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video. Are you an artist or a designer looking to sell your products in 2023? This guide will walk you through the connecting of Redbubble to Shopify. Explore how to seamlessly integrate your Redbubble products into your Shopify store right now in this video. So let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have the full information. So first of all guys, obviously head up to Shopify, so click in here and then head up to that and click into login right through here, simply like that. Now just go and make sure that you are on your store and there you have it. So now to actually connect to Redbubble, all you need to do is simply head up to the left side menu, go to the apps and here you will find this menu. Make sure to click here and search for the all recommended apps and then click into Shopify App Store right into the bottom of the page as you can see here. So click on it and there you will be redirected to this page. Here simply is a search for Redbubble and it will be fine over here. Sometimes you will not find it as you can see even though it's seamlessly uh, visible in the search without even writing it But you will not be able to find it in the marketplace. So what should we do in this position? Simply guys, there is other application that can be between these two which is Zapier Com. So Zapier is an application that literally can do any integration that you think of in the whole world apps. Now all you have to do first is head up to Zapier.com, create an account and make sure that you are logged in. The next thing is simply head up to the left side uh, menu as you can see and search for apps. Now for Shopify, obviously it will be here, but let's make sure that Redbubble also exists. So as you can see here, Redbubble, and it doesn't exist. As you can see, obviously it doesn't exist. So what should we do to actually make Redbubble connect into our Shopify store? First of all, make sure to sign up as your Redbubble account. Make an account, very easy. You just have to put here your uh, email, here name. So let's do that real quick. Uh, for example, something like that. And then here put a password. So we can just randomly pick a password. And here I'm going to add something like that. And choose that you are going to sign in as an artist, not as a customer. And here click on sign up and your account shall be created. So now here, as you can see, you will find your store, your uh, accessory products, everything about your account. Now, this is not important. The most important thing is that we need to actually have an account and then we can add designs later on to our accounts. Now here, simply I'm going to show you how you can simply add a design. You can either upload the new work or copy an existing work that you have already. So simply just upload the new work, for example, upload, choose for example uh, this design, upload it, give it a name, etc, etc, and it will be in all of these things. Now ignore all of that because this is not what is very important for us. Now we need to add Redbubble to Zapier. How to do so? Well, this is the point. To actually add any app that is not already has been added to their apps uh, library on Zapier, you have to get the premium or the pro plan. To get the pro plan, it might be pretty expensive for only connecting these two apps. So I'm going to show you real quick the, uh, the, the amount of money that you'll have to pay, which is pretty insane. So you'll have to pay around fifty dollars. Will tell me, okay, no, I'm going with this twenty dollar per month. Uh, unfortunately, this twenty dollar per month doesn't have the most two powered features, which are limited premium apps and custom logic with pets. These two are going to actually allow you to make and add a custom uh, app to your account. You can choose each month to change it to whatever you want, and this is what you have to go for. So simply all you have to do is choose how many tasks you want through here and then make sure to just upgrade your plan.
The next thing after you upgrade your plan, you will have to connect with the support, send them a message, and make sure to tell them that you want to use your unlimited premium apps and custom logic with path features to actually add Raybubble as um, as your second app. So now after you do so and you connect it, you will have to connect it as you will see now. So I'm going to show you an example with Shopify. So here it is, Shopify. Click into connect. They will open a new window. Go ahead and put here your link. So let me just copy this. I'm going to here, open this one. Let's continue to Shopify and give it a little bit of time. And now install app. Wait a little bit. And then you go. So here is my account. Let's test if it is working. Test successful. So now all we need to do is to do the same thing with Redbubble. So let's do the same thing that I have done with Shopify with Redbubble. After both applications are working correctly, let's click on Create Zap, which is right in the uh, left side of your screen. And there you go. So here is where magic happens. Simply here, just write whatever thing that you want to happen between Shopify and Redbubble, and it shall make it real. As an example, when I add new design to Redbubble, send it as new products in Shopify, and then click in generate and there you go here we have everything that we need now for me they will not show me Redbubble because I don't have it as an app but for you guys you might find it so here synchronization of Redbubble design to Shopify click on try it now and then all you have to do is to connect to Redbubble so now they are showing me another application and here connect to your Shopify account. So here, just choose your account, which is the last one that I have made. Then click on continue, add required things here. So let's choose something, go to complete this step, for example. You will have to connect to Redmine. And then after you connect these two and successfully made them work correctly, click here to make them on, fix to publish. And there you have it. Your uh, actions will be working and the integration of these two apps will be perfectly synchronized now so yeah this is very easy guys to do it doesn't even take uh, like 10 minutes of your time you just have to have both accounts ready to go and the integration that you want to make or the purpose of the integration that you want to make in your mind type it and you will have it as a uh, like automation for you ready by Zapier so yeah guys that was it for today's video if you do have any more questions make sure to leave them down below in the comment section hope you guys made some new informations while watching this video thanks a lot for watching and see you guys in the next tutorial